It's the Archivist, y'all. And we're catching up with Burner. I know what it is. Welcome back to Canada, my man, on the West Coast, on this side. Appreciate it. We, yeah. It feels good to be back out here, man, after getting through that border. We out here. You got your smoke on? It's all good? Yeah, yeah. We would be feeling good right now. And catching up with Burner since the TGOD 2050 tour. How was the rest of that? And then the Under the Influence tour, real serious. Man, it's been dope, man. Uh, you know, I like being on the road with my brothers, my Taylor Gang family and stuff like that. So you know, it's definitely a good experience. I'm looking forward to see what happens this summer. We on this Buds and Suds tour right now. Real well as well, selling our shows. Fucking with hoes. And back to when we met that urban farmer, it did over 100,000 in downloads and 400K on the views. They really know that was the landmark for you. And that uncut certified freak and drugs video. Yeah, yeah, man, you know, we like to have fun with what we do. Um, urban Farmer is definitely some one of my classic projects. You know, we put out a lot of projects, but I think Urban Farmer made a lot of noise and um, uncut videos is something I do great because I'm not scared to do it. A lot of these rap dudes got too many, you know, they can't do that kind of stuff. I could do that stuff. I got no one. I ain't tied up. I'm not cuffed up. And we're going to get into one of your majors, Phil of the Green Team. Speak on your best times with him and his legacy that he's left. Yeah, man, Phil, man, he put me where I'm at. So, you know, we're going to keep smoking for my boy Nice, man. Um, it's kind of a tragedy what happened with him, but it just kind of made sure that I, I do everything that, um, that I need to do. And, uh... I'm going to keep turning up for my boy Phil, man. FYM, fuck you, me and Green Team. Shout out to all my brothers, man. We're going to hold it down for nice. And in reference to your video packs, explain more on the hustle and what it took to get where you're at from the streets to the music. Man, the, uh, the rap game is like the dope game. So if you know how to be an aggressive, uh, aggressive businessman and you know how to put money behind yourself, you're not scared to lose, you definitely could take it to the next level. So. What we're doing right now, we're just trying to try and do what we need to do, and we ain't scared to lose, and we're going to keep pushing. So, I mean, streets definitely help. And the good life. What kind of whips are you riding? What kind of property? How many Rolexes do you got now? And that watch that I seen, 900K in the pinky ring? Ha. Life's good. Trips to Costa Rica. Yeah, yeah. No, nah, I didn't cop the $900,000 watch. I was just looking at it. I ain't go front. Um, as far as riding, I like to sit in the back of town cars now because I like to get high and pop a few Zans. Just do me. I got my eyes on a new McLaren. That's what I kind of want right now. That or a, a, a you know, Maybach. Um, but yeah, shit's good right now, man. We winning. I got a few places. I got over five spots. So, you know, I'll be in your city fucking with your bitch on the low, man. You know, you never know. I might be in your city right now. I mean, shit, I got, I got spots all over the place, all over the country. And I like to keep it that way. I don't want to just live in one spot. I like to move around. You know what I mean? And another side of life, out of music, your amazing daughter. What are some of the things that you enjoy doing together? Um, I just like to watch her smile, so anything she's doing where well, she's smiling, I'm happy. She's drawing or she's at the beach or, you know what I mean, we're just chilling or whatever it may be, watching movies, talking. I just like to be around her, so anything with her is definitely a positive thing for me. That's what I like to do. And then back when uh, you got started working with Gold Toes. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 18 with a Thiz, man. My boy Toes, man. Black and brown, ride a thug. You know what I mean? Thiz Latin. Shout out to my Thiz Latin family, you know? This is around the beginning of when I started messing with Gold Toes. Yeah. Can you tell us about the record? Um, shit, it's dope. It's dope. I wrote a lot of his verses on there. He likes when I write for him, because I know how to spit that shit. Yeah, 18 with a Thiz is hard. And then, working with Lee Majors? Oh, yeah. Yeah, put you on back in the day when you first got started? You yeah, start I've been working, working with Lee for a long time, man. Shout out to my boy Lee, man. That's my brother right there, man. Regine Gang. I've been working with Lee Majors for a long time, you know what I mean? That's the homie. We got some good records together. He's been on a lot of my projects. Definitely fuck with him the long way, you know? And what's going to be the next tour when you guys are going to tour together? Um, I'm not sure. Right now, I'm just kind of like, you know, I'm just doing my thing. I think the next tour might be... There's word, uh, maybe, there's talk of maybe going on tour with Currents here, just doing my own headline tour, 20 Lights Drops. Business, cookies, hemp, tuo, water, fresh co, power moves and capsules with Snoop, rolling trays, trippy sticks, keychains, let us know you're a connoisseur of the business. Man, I just want to have $200 million in my bank account so I can fuck off and do whatever I want to do. So, you know, we all know one thing. I know business, you know, people are always going to need to smoke. 
They're always going to need to wear clothes. They're always going to have to drink something. They're always going to need to be entertained and watch movies and film. I mean, there's just too many things you could do to, you know, to be on. And at the end of the day, if you want to live a certain way, then you have to go ahead and push for it, you know, for that, for that dream, for that goal. And traveling all across the U.S., some of the best strip clubs you've been to? Uh, Sam's Hot Bra in L.A. is probably the best strip club um, just because it's like, Got the ATL feel, like the Texas feel, but it's got all Latin girls in that motherfucker. So they're playing trap music, big booty Latin bitches up in there. You know what I mean? I, I like Sam's Half Bra. Of course, I'm gonna be on Broadway Street, Centerfold, Showgirls. Oh, it's actually Penthouse now. So I like stripper girls. They're trouble, but fun. You gotta check out Brandy's out here. Brandy's? Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna slide through the Brandy's. Yep, gotta be that before you leave. And uh, classic phone pranks, any impersonations for us? You kill it. Oh man, you know, I, I, I like to prank call, man. I, I definitely, when I get high on board, I definitely, I'm probably gonna prank call when they got me stuck at the border on the way back. I might catch one of your favorite rappers slipping, man. And it's the life. What's the most money that you've ever held? And the highest that I've heard is over 450K. Uh, nah, I've held more than that. I've definitely held more than that. I've definitely held more than 450,000. Counted out by hand. No money counter, not weighing it. That shit feels good until your thumbs hurt, until you're tired of seeing it. Once you count so much money, it's, it's not really fun anymore. You just want to, you just want to stack more and more and more and more, and just you realize uh, you know the important things. But uh, are we reaching into the millions? Oh, it's over a mil for sure. Excellent. Yeah, it's over. It, we in the mills already. Yeah, money's money's my friend. And drugstore cowboy cookies and cream with San Quinn, dirty money compilation, and that red wine remix with Lee Majors. Yeah. Red Wine Remix is dope. Dirty Money Comp is like, uh, I put that together for the Bay, put on all the artists I fuck with, let them know I ain't changed one bit ever since the Taylor Gang situation. That sound is still really relevant and it's uh, it's needed and, uh, you know, at the end of the day, it's, it's dope. Dirty Money's doing great, it sounds great. I gotta work with Jack again. So, you know, that's one of my favorite artists. Um, a lot of people that don't know me look up Another Day. It's one of the crowd's favorite songs every time I perform it. And the newest videos, Chapo, Come On, Racing, Bad For Your Health, Paradise, featuring Wiz Khalifa, Wax Room with Nipsey Hussle. You working and those numbers are totally on and up. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're, we're, we're the million boys, man. Turn up. We, we get big views, you know what I mean? Shout out to my team, Wiz. Chapo's a movie. You know, shout out to Nip. You know, Wax Room is definitely a, a, a street classic right now. You know what I mean? Like, Shit, man, we just we were trying to make some noise. Shout out to Stingy, my boy Stingy in the building, made Paradise. Phil Collins was gonna sue us, but he ain't made a move yet. Shout out to Phil, man. Don't worry about it, Phil, man. If you wanna uh, if you wanna come get your mind, my baby, come holler at your boy Big Burn, man. We gonna get high and talk about this shit, man. Come on, man, don't sue me, baby. Don't sue me, baby. Come on, man, keep one, don't sue me. <laughs> you don't know, man. And the prequel EP, 20 Lights, working with Sage the Gemini's album. Mm -hmm. Now tour plans, and now you're on the Buds and Suds tour. Yeah, I don't really plan singles. I don't really care too much about the radio. I just make music for the streets, for people that like to ride and smoke, for um, for the culture and the generation that I'm repping. They decide to play me on the radio. That's great, but I'm definitely not uh, not worried about it at all. I'm not really focusing on making any music for the radio. Twenty Lights is gonna be dope. I got some dope features on there. Um, you know, I got one with uh, with Currency and Jack on there. I'm um, working on doing one with Devin and Snoop. I'm definitely gonna probably get Sage, 40, and uh, I Am Sue on there. Just people I fuck with. Really shout out to E42, man. Ambassador to the Bay Area. That's my brother, man. And how do you feel about the Canada weed? Because in the past on GGN, you were saying it was kind of bougie, but you know, it didn't you know, come through. <clears throat> yeah, no, you came through. Canada weed is good. You just gotta know the right people. I mean, at the end of the day, you know, I'm a Bay Area boy. I'm a rep one from 100%. You know, the Sherbert, the F1, the Cookies, the Y, the Snowman. You know, all of them strains is just a uh, acquired taste, you know what I mean? So I'm sure they got it out here, man. Just got to find it. I found some good weed. They have a lot of bub out here, man. Y'all need to, you know, watch that, man. Get rid of that. Get some cookie cuts. Grow some cookies out here, man. Y'all got everything you need. You got the establishments. You got the, you know, the laws. Blow that cookie up, man. Blow that cookie up out here in Canada. We want to see Canadian cookies next time I come out here. Canadian cookies. I want to see it. And how is South by Southwest and still Summer Jam? South by Southwest was a movie too. We shut it down. Ain't no one's partying like us out there. It's big. Yeah, Excellent. It's huge. And you have another best hip hop memory for us that you've been part of or contributed to since we caught up? Uh, I'd be around a lot of shit. You know, I was definitely there for a lot of classic Wiz records when they were being made. 
I mean, every day is a classic hip hop story for me. Shit, I'm, I'm, I'm in it. I'm on tour right now. I'm, you know, I think probably maybe one of my favorite ones recently is. Uh, I don't know. It's just a lot of stuff. We're winning. And you have anything to say to your fans worldwide? Keep smoking. Keep smoking. Keep repping. You already know what it is. TGOD, Cookies SF, Hemp 2 Good Life Merch, Fresh Go, Cookie Co Consulting, Marijuana Mania. You ain't even know what that is yet. That's going to be the next big thing. We're going to keep going. 200 mil boys. And you got any shots? Yeah, man. Shout out to everyone that fucks with me genuinely, man, because we've been rocking it. We've been through a lot to get where we're at, so if you fuck with me the long way, I fuck with you the long way. I appreciate the love and support. And shouts to Gold Toes and Cool Nuts oh, and yeah. the Buds and Suds Tour shout and to, Burner. Yeah, shout out to everyone on this tour, man. It's been an amazing experience. We're just going to keep it pushing. And this is The Archivist, and you already know the name, y'all. Yeah, you already know what it is. Man. Respect.